al zoveel jaren geleden uh, bewonder ik de postkaarten, de aanzichtkaarten van Suriname met schilderijen van Paul Hoy. En toen ik in de 80er jaren op Jumu werkte, uh, is hij me een keer komen opzoeken. En toen mijn huis keek uit op de Tapawatra waterval. Toen zei ik van schilder voor me, schilder die Tapawatra waterval voor me. En dan schilder het op een muur in dit huis. Maar gelukkig heb ik het niet gedaan, want ik ben natuurlijk nou een poos verhuisd. En ik zou die muur niet kunnen meenemen. Een jaar geleden heb ik gezegd, Paul, ik denk dat ik nu hard genoeg gewerkt heb. Ik ben nu met pensioen bij de Verenigde Naties. Maak een schilderij voor me. Ik wil een inheemse vrouw een mooi schilderij van je hebben. Ze is een jaar geleden begonnen. Laag op laag op laag. En ik ging steeds kijken en het werd steeds mooier en steeds dieper en steeds voller. En uh, vandaag hangt Taigimi in mijn huis en vandaag komt Paul Woei het signeren thuis bij mij. Heel bijzonder. layer on layer. It's a very old Dutch technique from the 15th century on egg. They started and they conquered the whole world and they changed the way the painting was uh, displayed. Formerly it was totally different and the brothers from egg, they start with one color blue for instance, very thin, and they use a special medium, um, a kind of oil from a tree. May I sit, please? Yeah. I cannot. Yeah. I'm 81, so yeah. I have all the right. <laughs> could, you speak, could you speak in this, Paul, so we can get it on the recording? Sit, 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 sit. Just take it. <laughs> what was I talking about? Oh, yeah, the layer. The blue paint, and they wait one day, and after the medium dried out, they put a yellow layer on it, and part that is this uh, covered between blue and yellow be turned into green, and the yellow that is uh, on the canvas is in, without touching the blue will s remain yellow. That's how this painting was. It is sort of the eye, for instance, you see a bit blue and a bit red, white, but it's about 20 layers on it. Wow. And that's why the, you can see the eyeball yeah. is, is round, yeah. but you will not feel it, uh, you will not see it. You'll only feel it. That's the purpose of art. Emotional uh, contact. And that is a very difficult technique. Nowadays, uh, not many artists are using this technique, but this cumbersome takes a long while, and you don't earn much money. For the same time, you earn twice the amount of money using acrylic. This was the requirement of the collector. I couldn't find it when I finished. Because we then need a ceremony. Ero me goyano Ay Curano maroyano One, one more explanation. She's looking through the leaves through the, in the jungle into the outside world. And the, and the title is 
I'm asking you, me ta, me ask you, me tagi you. Tagi me, tagi me. But then, um, this you often see in the jungle when you come on shore with the boat. All the girls are curious, who is this guy coming to the village? And you will not see them, but if you look good between the leaves, you will see this. And those leaves are in, on purpose. This kind of leaf, we call it Bengali, no? The flower Bengali. Bongo. Bongo. But in English is Bengali. Heavenly Bengali. And um, along the river bank. And with long strings of flowers. And this is a symbol of the riverside along the shore with only leaves, few leaves, nothing else to suggest the river bank. And under in the water, you have all the fish because the seed of the flower and the pot fall into the water and all the fish are there. So whenever you see this, throw your hangle, you hope, and, and you'll find the fish. <laughs> Thank you very, very much. We enjoyed.